So we are back with another summonable unit showcase, with this being the STR Bojack that you can summon as an SR in Dokkan Battle in pretty much any banner. And then he awakens to the SSR, which then awakens to this TUR form. Cool story, bro. And what's special about this Bojack is that he actually has a lot of potential to output so much damage. So let's get into the card detail really quickly. As always, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. First off, his stats, 11,145 HP, 11,160 attack, 6,913 defense. He only does have 3,002 all stats, so he's not one of those special ones. Level 120 TUR with a lead skill of STR types key plus 2, attack and defense plus 50%. His super attack is extreme damage and greatly lowers defense. Um, unfortunately, that's the worst part about him. He does not get the Supreme Damage Multiplier. But luckily, with his passive skill, he does get a lot of attack boost, which is 90% attack boost when you perform a super attack. I just gave him maximum critical on his ability system, level 20, with a little bit of additional, a little bit of dodge, of course. Since he doesn't have that much defense, it's better to be safe than sorry. For the Link skills, um, like many of these SR summonable cards, they are pretty decent. Heraclan, Galactic Warriors, Big Bad Bosses. First World Conquest, Coward, Wall Standing Toll, and Shattering the Limit. With four categories here, we have Resurrected Warriors, Movie Bosses, Full Power, and of course, Time Travelers. So we're going to be running him under a Movie Bosses category team, and then we're going to go up against the Future Gohan so that we have type advantage. So let's get straight into it. It's a very similar team to what I was using to showcase the Inchin Ember, hoping that I upload the Inchin Ember's showcase before this. If not, then I just spoiled it. Question mark. <laughs> but if you haven't seen it, make sure you check it out in the near future. I don't know. Uh, I'm just making a bunch of videos because I'm super bored at this time of day. <laughs> okay. So, we do not have him at the first rotation. I'm going to check like this. This Bojack, the tech Bojack we're bringing, is a really good linking partner. Has most of the attack links that we're looking for. Um, hopefully, Brawler doesn't steal the showcase too much. We do have type advantage... Three out of the four phases, so that's good for the Bojack. On the negative side, we don't have any other units that are STR. But I'm assuming Brawly's, you know, uh, defense should be efficient enough to tank majority of the stuff here. And of course, our goal is to get underneath the 80%, so we do get big bad bosses. Get an additional super attack. Not needed at all. Maybe in a different rotation, but definitely not that rotation. Okay, so let's go like this. Uh, we have the support. Actually, I'm going to go like this. That way we take a hit here, and then we can activate big bad bosses, because I do know that the cell does have big bad bosses. So that's a good thing to have. 71,000 attack stat right now. The defense stat is probably super low, like 20,000, maybe 30,000. Big super attack here. That's going to lose a lot of our HP. 94,000, but we do get big bad bosses now, making him almost 800,000 attack stat, 738,000 damage, which is pretty, pretty good. Okay, so now we're onto the tech. Uh, we do have a few tech units in, I mean, inch units in here, so that's pretty good. Uh, for now, let's go like this. We can stun, I believe, so I'm not going to use, you know what? Um, let's go and use a healing item here. That way, uh, we don't die. Maybe we can still lose enough HP for the big bad bosses next turn. That's if if we super attack. Get super attacked. Okay. Um, this might stun. That would probably be bad. Okay, no stun. That's good. Alright, you're going to super attack us? No, but 48,000... That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I think that should be enough. As long as I don't get the colored orb so we heal a little bit, then we should be able to get underneath 80%. I'll still super attack with the um, cell here. Yes. All right. Perfect. So we are guaranteed to get the big bad bosses. Unfortunately, it's not type disadvantage, but with Freezer, we're able to increase the extreme allies attack even further. Twice, actually. Since we got the additional super, that's one of the effects of Freezer's super attacks. Now we jumped up to 1.1 million attacks that with 825,000 damage on type disadvantage. Neutral.
neutral damage. I'm gonna see that million. We have to see that million as we take so much damage here. <laughs> Broly's gonna transform. I'm gonna... Let's, um... Let's definitely go for the kill here. Don't worry, we probably won't die. I'm gonna eat my words soon, aren't I? Uh, we gotta keep this Goku in, because the Turles does have big bad bosses as well. So I do want that to happen. And of course, the Int Goku is the only problem on this team, because now we're gonna have to have him take type disadvantage throughout the whole fight. And, um... He doesn't get that much boost. His support doesn't even activate for any of these units, as we get one point... Almost 1.1 million critical. Alright, on to physical now. This is going to be beautiful. We got big bad bosses. Not the best rotation because the... Um... Because the Cell actually provides support. Well, this Bojack doesn't. But he has all the links that the Bojacks have, obviously. If two people are almost... If it's two of the same characters, they're most likely going to be linking pretty well. And with Yemma, we, yes, all right, cool. Gonna take no damage there. Let's see, what we can do here in terms of damage, this is now we're onto the type disadvantage. Advantage, we have advantage. Almost a million attacks that with only, what, big bad bosses and only one super attack, getting 777,000 damage. Lot of room to increase for sure. And we're just constantly lowering defense. Alright, I'm going to go Sasha here because that is necessary. Let's go like that. We're just stuck on this little bit of amount of HP. Just trying to get through. Trying to keep that big bad bosses for sure. Get uh, 700,000 damage. Not bad. Of course, it's going to be an additional super. Why would it, it be? This is probably going to kill if it's a crit. Yep. Alright. <laughs> when you have such an OP friend, it's these showcases tend to go really short. Okay, not the best rotation once again. But we can use a Yammer here. And I think we'll be fine. Let's just grab as many colored orbs, uh, but not too much. Because <laughs> we want to get the Doka mode with the Bojack at the very least. And that is coming. That should, if we collect the right amount of orbs on the next rotation, the right colored orbs, um, we should be good. Okay. No additional super. 873,000 attacks that. A little bit less. Oh, the thing that we lacked that uh, we had before with the Bojack is um, the Hera Clan or the Galactic Warriors link. That was it. So that was an extra 20% attack boost. So that was pretty good actually. Oh, we can stun on this. Wow. That's actually really good. <laughs> okay, so let's not get the same colored orbs and we'll actually have a really good rotation. To just do a doka mode. Okay, he, he won't kill. But of course, the additional super attack. I don't think this future Gohan is going to last any longer. Probably this last attack is all we got. Even another additional. Additional normal critical. So a big chunk. Okay. We're definitely going to go Sasha. And... We are going to... I'm going to do this. Um, the big bad bosses is just way more important right here than... What is Brutal Beatdown? So, goodbye, Freezer. You were good. But I hope we can get um, some big damage here. Let's break that one meal. We've been lowering defense for quite some time as well. Okay, okay, okay. 897,000 attacks that are not at the million, unlike the other rotations that we had previously. But let's get that critical with the Doka mode. No, but 1.27 million damage. Guys, that was <laughs> such an awesome card and very easy to obtain. The only hard part about it is the medals. That's definitely a big grind, but 
Anyway, guys, that's going to wrap up the showcase. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. Make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. On the top right corner, there's going to be a poll. Make sure you vote in that, whether or not this guy is worth the orbs or not. But anyway, I'll see you in the next video. As always, have a good day. Stay busy. Peace out.